Bill Smith, Summertime. Check it out. Drums, please! <laughs> And if it ain't broke, then don't try to fix it. And think of the summers of the past. Adjust the bass and let the alpine blast. Pop in my CD and let me run around and put your car on cruise and lay back, cause it's summertime. And checking out the fellas to tell them who's best Riding around in your Jeep or your Benzos Or in your Nissan sitting on Lorenzo's Back in Philly we be out in the park A place called the Plateau is where everybody go Guys out hunting and girls doing likewise Honking at the honey in front of you with the light eyes She turn around to see what you beeping at It's like the summer's a natural aphrodisiac And with a pen and pad I compose this rhyme To hit you and to get you equipped for the summertime Definition of summer madness. Will Smith with Summertime. Let's get into... Hmm, what should we fucking do for to follow up some Will Smith? You know what? Let's switch up the genre just a little bit and do some Fleetwood Mac. 
got to. This will Fleetwood Mac really quick, and then some, uh... Oh, can we do it back-to-back -back this early on? Nah, we'll just do Fleetwood Mac right now, and then we'll see what we're doing after that. Sorry, I'm all discombobulated. My weed hasn't kicked all the way in yet. I feel kind of, like, off without being super stoned. <laughs> this is Fleetwood Mac with Dreams. Check it out. I downloaded the old school vinyl version. I mean, you can't hear the difference, but I know it's the vinyl version, and I feel happy about that. 
in honor of Throwback Thursday. You can still buy vinyls at certain places, too. That's one of my fucking... That's going to be one of my next purchases, man. It's going to be a vinyl fucking record player. Play some of that old school shit. Because I actually found... I want to say I was at a fucking... Not a Goodwill, but... It's one of those little low-key thrift stores. It's like a privately owned one. I travel around a lot, and when I travel, I usually hit up the thrift stores because they always got cool shit. And depending on what area you're in, you could see what type of people are in that area by seeing what gets donated to the fucking thrift store. And I found, and I should have bought it. I kicked myself in the ass daily for not buying it then, but at the time, I was like, oh, I don't have a vinyl player. And now I'm like, fuck, I could have still got it, though. It was the fucking Dr. Day Chronic on vinyl, the original Chronic. Uh, I gotta go online and find that shit. But, uh, I don't know, we got this little slow, soft rock vibe going. Let's get in some Eric Clapton. Wonderful tonight. Check it out. It's hard to call it radio when it's this out of the box. Listen to that. 
Ben. You know just what to say. You 